Hey guys, Zangcraft here, and today we have a bit of a gaming video, um, sort of. So, um, Microsoft has decided to raise its price on Xbox Live Gold. Now, if you guys don't know, Xbox has been my platform for the past five years. I defend, um, the console and stuff, and I really hate when people br go into console war territory, but... This is just retarded what they have done to um, Xbox Live. So, if you guys know, um, Xbox Live used to be like this. One month is $10. Three months is $30 or $25. And then it goes up to 12 months. And it is... $60 for 12 months and that is a really good deal and a lot of people go with that deal and I went with that deal last year and um, they switched it so now Xbox Live is $10 for $10 for um, one month $40 for three and then 60 for six now um i would say this is unexpected but it's not unexpected of microsoft so um back in uh december or maybe early no no it's december back in december i really wanted to um get a like, I have Xbox Live Gold, but I wanted to get the Game Pass, and they had a $1 deal. But what I was looking at was not a $1 deal. It was actually $1 more than what it usually is. Now, the Xbox Live Game Pass is, is like, $15 for, for three months, and they, or for a month. And then they had a deal, and it was three months for one dollar. I click this deal, then it wants fifteen dollars. Now I keep trying and trying again. I thought these things happen, but then I looked in, in into it more, and it's a one dollar scam. And this infuriated me a lot because I bought the game pass before. It's just fifteen dollars normally. But now it is 16 if you took this deal. If you took the deal of $1, you bought it, you were paying for, you were paying $16 for a subscription. I think it's a scam uh, mainly to grab the money out of your pocket if you have your card on there or your PayPal and it, it's just not cool. So seeing this really, really infuriated me. And I kind of had a talk with my friend Michael and my dad about it. And yeah, so I just don't think Microsoft is just like what it used to be. Like that is a really, really strange change that they make years in xbox live has been around since what the 360 so so around let's say i want to say 2008 but well let's just take let's just say 2008 2009 uh 12 13 years for the past 12 or 13 years it's been the same, and then now they flick the switch, and they want more money for 12 months than what it was used to. And, um, P.S., a lot of people are saying that, like, on Twitter and a lot of other places, that, that like, people should just switch to PlayStation. And honestly, I agree, because this is just stupid. Like... You want to play one month, yes, you can keep rolling out your $1 subscriptions, but if you wanted to play 12 months without having to pay it for for a whole year, 
you could have bought in the 12 month subscription for $60, which was actually a really good deal. My mom was looking at it when she bought it for me back in May and she's like, wow, wait, you serious? Only $60 for this? And I'm like, yeah. And then she's like, all right, I'll buy it. I mean, that's a really good deal. So it's just stupid. And plus the three month change, come on. Now it's like $35. I looked at the price, 30, 40. It's just, Microsoft is having a big brain fart. And that's not okay for the community because like, I, f I it's either you make your, your online game free like all the other platforms or you make xbox live gold what the game pass is like i didn't realize the game pass was like all these games until very recently that's why i tried to get it again but but like xbox live you only play you you pay all this money now uh just for uh, online games with like like uh, Minecraft servers and and Fortnite and um, Destiny Warzone a lot of the a lot of online games and um, the only other perks are like what two three games for free they suck and and I guess one one discount one discount the game pass is a lot more but it's way more expensive so why the hell do you increase the normal live it, it just doesn't make sense and it puts people like me who respect xbox the wrong way like it's just you can't defend microsoft on this because like it's been this way for years and now they're finally changing it it's just they're money hungry and i don't know if it's because of the release of the playstation 5 and how good the sales are going from there for them and the xbox series x like like i like the series x but playstation has a lot a lot more profit and that's because of its exclusives that's because of the look that's because of um, the graphics change. But Xbox has what? Assassin's Creed Valhalla? And that game wasn't even really well received. That's basically it. And, and like, there's, there's really, really no reason to be increasing this price. I just don't think it's a good idea. And... I don't know. I think this is going to be one of the final days for Xbox unless they change something. Unless they change Xbox Live to just just like very like you you get tons of games for free content and get rid of the Game Pass like say you take you turn Xbox Live uh you take out Xbox Live uh game pass and then you turn the normal live into the xbox live game pass i feel like that would be a great change and would make sense for the money increase let's say the more money you put into it uh you don't only get more months online but uh, you don't only get more months online but you also get more games but if people are just paying if people are p paying like a hundred and twenty dollars um, one of four quarters of how much their console was just to play for a year. That doesn't make sense. Give them, give them more. You need, and you need at least like a couple games on there if, if you want them to pay $120 for a subscription. Xbox has been the only one carrying the subscription monthly. PS Plus is just exclusive stuff monthly. Uh, Nintendo, I don't think they even have one. And PC, you just have Steam, and they and they just buy their games, but whatever. But Xbox has just kept this 
crap for way too long and increasing the price was the biggest mistake they have ever made. So anyway, guys, uh, thank you for watching this update, and it's good to get into a bit of more gaming content, but this stuff actually does piss me off. So, yeah, see you guys in the next video. Peace out.